Hey everybody, it's Rob from Flailthroughs. This is Gundam Battle Operation 2, and this is the update for August the 6th. It's the first update of the month, so GBO days are in effect. Um, so yeah, there's a three-starred MS guaranteed uh, roll. There's also a bunch of other uh, rolls up. Um, one free supply request every day for the weekend, and of course the free 10 roll is renewed for this week as well. Uh, with the second uh, year anniversary stuff, but more importantly, the Cubely is here. So, was not really expecting that this week. But I may actually do a 10 roll for that, just because uh, I'd like a Haman silly pilot suit with the big shoulders. That would be nice. But, yeah, that's up. There's a 72-hour unacquired mobile suit boosted supply drop. Or no, I think that's... Oh yeah, that one's been running. No, this is the 72-hour uh, limited one. Um, you get one uh, uh, guaranteed MS and a half off 10 spin. Um, the list from four really good hand-picked mobile suits. I'm assuming it's the Rick DS, the Yahushiki, the Gun Mark II, and one other. And yeah, in in your uh, in your well with uh, Needheart, uh, aka Nick Fury, you will find uh, the MS enhancement pack, which is 200,000 DP, um, and. Uh, a bunch of mechanic tickets and modification kits. So yeah, all kinds of stuff here. And we've almost uh, worked our way through all our clan rewards. Uh, good luck to all trying to do the same. But I'm just going to collect my stuff here. Yeah. yeah, got all that stuff. Oh, and there she is. I got the... Uh, uh, finally got the uh, holo actor version of the character from Maxi Boost on. Probably you'll see more of that next week, depending on when I get time to uh, record. But let's see. Might get a new. Uh... Yep, I was about to say might get a uh, monthly mission for the DP. But okay, so before we do any spinning, because there is wow, that's a lot of different stuff. But okay, let's start with the DP store. Um, level three Juagu is up. Level 2 Gym Guard Custom, level 3 Zaku Heavy Arms, which I do like. Um, eh, not, not unreasonably priced either. Um, Gym Guard is good, Juagu is good, Bo both very solid. Uh, weapons for both are up, and I have all of those. Um, any new custom parts? Nope, all stuff that has been here a while. Um, let's check out the DP store. And, or the recycle store, excuse me, we just looked at the DP store. Okay, everything up I have, but the GOG is back up. That's relatively cheap. Level 2 powered gym, that's quite good. Draw C is decent. Um, Zaku Mine Layer, Gym Command, Gigan. I guess the GOG is the new one. That was monthly missions last October, so... Or special missions, rather. So, yeah, that's... That's been a ways, uh, a while off, so... If you want to get a hold of the GOG, it is up for getting, and it is, it's fun to use, so if you want it, it's probably worth grabbing. Main weapons, um, let's see. I expected the GOG's main weapon to be here, but it, since it's been in the DP store since the GOG was introduced, I guess they wouldn't bother. Um, let's see, any new custom parts? Nope, nothing new, at least not at this uh, level. Okay, new uh, markings, Neo Zeon Axis markings are now in the store, so... That's not bad. I wonder if, I, since they're specifying Axis, I'm assuming we will get Glemmy faction markings eventually. But for now, um, let's see. Let us, let's start with the, let's start with the, uh, single free special supply drop and go there. I'm going to do the half price roll. I don't think I'm going to uh, roll on the Cubely banner yet. I'm still trying to keep enough for the... Guaranteed MS next, uh, next, uh, session, but boom. Gim Camouflage level 1, that's about normal. Okay, let us do the other special supply drop with the free 10 roll. But yeah, trying to, uh, save up, it's, I think it's a couple of weeks off yet to get the, uh, uh, step up where you can get a guaranteed pre-release mobile suit. We don't know what it is yet, but we're, I'm hoping for that. Let's see. Boom. Zaku FS level 6, so it can have some enhancement points. Boom! Rick Dom level 3, likewise. Oh, Fat Uncle, and boom! Level 2, okay, the, I forgot the level 2 Zaku Bazooka was a 2 star, but man, I've had that forever. Boom! Late model Beam Saber, likewise I've had forever. Boom! 
Okay, so okay I didn't have the level 3 missile launcher for the gym sniper yet. Isaac Heat Hawk I had. Ooh, gal. Zaku 1 commander type, which is a 2 star. I had it, but some enhancement value is not going to hurt that. Bad on uh, level 4 grenades for the Freak Custom. I have the, I have them. Zagaki Beam Cannon. We have not seen our guaranteed 3 star yet. Ooh. Level 4 early production Gelgug, which I have and is maxed out, so I get mechanic tickets. And that was my guaranteed 3 star. Man, there's a level 5 and I don't have it yet. Why Why couldn't you have done that for me? Come on. But, okay, so there's that. And one more. Let's see, this is the one... Yeah, this is the one with the half-off spin. I'm going to do the half-off spin. I probably already have all the hand-picked units, but... See what I can do. I should have been saving tokens on the other account, because I will not be able to get 15 tokens I uh, together in 72 hours. Say la vie! Boom! Uh, Gunner Gundam Beam Rifle Level 2. Uh, get another repeat. Fat Bishop Level 2. Repeat. Boom! Enhanced Heat Saber. Repeat. Boom! At least... Okay, Level 4 Gim Camuff Bazooka. At least this pool is the standard pool, not everything that has ever been in the, uh, in the uh, supply pool. Boom. Boom! Link Twin Beam Sabers. Had them forever. Boom! Collision level 4, that could be handy, especially for that XAML. Boom. Uh, modified Heat Sword level 5, got it. Boom. Okay, Beam Saber Enhanced Prototype 5, I probably have something good for that. Boom. Hyper Beam Rifle 3, I had. Boom. Full Armor Gundam Ground level 2, I'll take it. And, okay, that's, that must be one of the... Uh, Handpicked rare mobile suits then, because that's that's what they're giving me. It's not a bad thing to have. I just was kind of expecting, since the things they show are like the Rick Diaz, the Kakushiki, things like that, I was expecting something a little more Zeta. But, yeah, going to go back to saving at this point. Um, yeah, because... Yep, yeah, I will leave that. Yeah, definitely leave that alone. Yeah, I'll do one single spin for the Jubilee, because why not? Let's see, you know, it's August, let's see if the Gacha Curse extends to battle operation. Though my battle operation luck has been consistently weirdly good, so who even knows. Boom. Well, hi there. Okay, let's just call that part of my regular uh, luck and not part of my Gacha Curse, please, because I'd like to not have my Gacha Curse, please. But let's, well, let's take a look at this beast for a few minutes. Um, God, that's, well, okay, I'll take it. Recycle tickets, recycle tickets, recycle tickets, monthly missions, and I'm assuming number five is you've got a monthly mobile suit, hooray. And, 60, okay, you can't tell me the Kubli is not a monthly mobile suit. Okay, yeah, she's, uh... She's uh, available now as my uh, narrator. I'll probably set that up at some point. Let's look at that Kubli. It is, of course, a 650, as if there was any doubt. It is available on ground and space. Um, has beam guns. Only one level of it. Has double beam sabers. Three different funnel attacks. Pincer, surround, and pursue. Side, rear, and follow, basically. Um, not bad, not bad. Uh, not high damage, but again, they're going to multiply that by uh, by six if they all hit, so... Yeah, so it's got a bunch of funnel fun. And let's see. Yeah, so that's that. Speed, uh, let's see. Abilities. Double dodge roll. Level two leg buffer. Uh, flight control, so you can do a bunch of stuff in the air. And back, not surprising. Level two force injectors for, you know, quick maneuvering. That makes sense for a new type use mobile suit. Um, harder to stun repeatedly with damage control. High performance radar level 2. 30% uh, percent damage reduction on the big silly shoulders. Uh, balancers for that melee and two melee swings. It is a general, incidentally, which I had not mentioned before. So, okay. There we go. I'm going to register that for ground use and I'm going to go try and record a, a match with it. So hopefully you will see that like tomorrow morning, possibly. I may start pushing things back in the schedule. At any rate, though, that is going to do it for this Gundam Battle Operation 2 update. We will be back soon with more, so till next time, everybody take care and have fun. Later!